Hey y'all, hey, I am back for another episode of Kiera's Creations. Anywho, um, when I did binge watch Wednesday, I binge watched Rascal and Lucy. Um, I believe it was Rascal and Lucy. Anyway, I watched Kitty Cats for six hours and I decided let's do a kitty set well i was gonna do a kitty set at first but then i was like hmm i'm just gonna do a extra 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 long nail so these are two 3x nails put together and i'm outside y'all <laughs> y'all know i'm always outside i'm trying to <sighs> get a little breather and come out here and talk to y'all so anyway while i was um doing this set i was thinking about my kitty that i used to have and y'all i just i grew up with cats like i've always had a, a animal and it's always been a cat sometimes i'd have a dog but i always had a cat growing up always had a cat growing up um I love cats and I just I don't know I guess just because I know the behaviors I just know how cats are you know if you're a cat person like leave in the comments you know something that you feel like is interesting about cats now candy is scared of cats she said and she's also scared of kittens y'all how in the world can you be afraid of a little kitten? A kitten? <laughs> and then I thought it was interesting because Raven said on Raven's reviews, she said, my grandma says they walk in two worlds and are of the devil. <laughs> the devil? Really? She said, never mess with a West Indian grandparent. I've met some wonderful kittens and also some terrifying ones. I agree. Um, and I responded, I believe that cats can sense evil. Now, that's one thing. If they're not evil. Now, there are some evil cats out there. And I just feel like, you know... Um, there's just evil, you know, just like there's evil people in the world, just like there's evil dogs, there's evil cats, just like, you know, on my mail route, I see some dogs that just seem like they have the spirit of Satan in them. They're like, just crazy barking and trying to do anything and everything they can to get out the fence. And I will never, ever, ever, ever deliver a package at one of those houses like that because they're just like it's just like they're out for blood and you have cats that are like that too that are just like Arr! and then you know they they swing their tail aggressively y'all know what i'm talking about the cat people know what i'm talking about how they you know there are different behaviors so it's that kind that's when they're gonna attack you okay when they're really upset they start swinging their tail like they're pissed off okay it's just it's the certain swing that they have now when they're playing with you you know their tail will be different and then they'll like get down and then they'll like wiggle their little booty and then they'll like run for you and you know they're like they're like playing so it's just different i do agree cats can be assholes like i just love cats because they have a your trust has to be earned not given with a cat a cat is just not going to just love you just because like you have to earn their love um a dog is not like that a dog is just loyal um at a fault dogs are you know some dogs i guess are like are not like that i don't know i really don't know that much about dog. i know about dogs but i know more about cats i mean 
So anyway, let me tell y'all a quick story while I'm doing these nails. So when I was married to my ex-husband, right, I had was at work. Um, this is when I used to work at the jail. Um, and this girl had brought a little bitty Siamese kitten. And I was like, oh, my gosh. Like, where did you get it? She brought it to work. And she told me that um, full-blooded Siamese kitten. And she told me that there was one left and that she could bring it to me. So I was like, okay, so I got it, right? Um, when that kitten became old enough not even an adult cat but just you know maybe um about six months not even a year old i kid you not that cat used to attack my ex-husband my husband at that time every single day when he would come home from work she would attack him y'all and I thought she was playing with him, but she used to literally attack him like she was trying to take down a gazelle. Like she was a lion trying to take down a gazelle. She would jump onto his leg and like just be holding on to his leg. And he he worked in the factory, so he had on jeans and boots. So, of course, he couldn't feel anything. But she would literally just wrap around his leg crawling up and down like biting scratching and he'd be kicking his leg and acting like he's playing with her like oh yeah you're hurting me you're hurting me like you know being sarcastic to her and stuff like that but um and she but she was dead ass serious like when she got off of his leg her ears would be back and she would have that look like she was pissed and she did that for years y'all for years we got divorced and then I ended up giving her away to this lady um that had other animals and um I hope she's taking good care of her she wanted me to um give she wanted to give me her number and she was like you could check up on her but I was like no it's just too much but you anyway after we got divorced I got rid of her because you know I had got her while we were married and I didn't want to keep her because I don't know. I didn't have time for her anymore. And she was so cute, y'all. Um, but, yeah. This is what she looked like. But, um, I just didn't have time for her anymore. But I got a, I got a couple of videos of her attacking him. This is legit footage, y'all. Of her attacking him. And... Now I see why she did that. She sensed evil on him, y'all. That man, let me tell you. And I'm not just saying it because that's my ex. I'm not just saying it because that's my ex, y'all. He was legit evil, y'all. Straight evil. I had so many weird things happen to me in my household when he was there that just stopped happening after he left thank goodness I didn't stay with him that long I was able to get away but yes he was legit evil and I believe the cat since it she never treated me like that y'all she was always nice to me if she was you know wanting to play then she would play but it wasn't like she was trying to break blood like she would be trying to bl break blood on him and now i see why but anyway guys let me know in the comments your experiences with cats i absolutely love cats i don't have any animals right now just because i don't have time for them all i have is fish see you guys in the next video love you guys thank you all for my 300 subscribers the giveaway will be coming soon, so stay tuned, turn on your notifications, and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye. This is the cutest thing ever. 
cutest thing, cutest thing, cutest thing ever. This is the cutest thing, cute, cutest thing. This is the cutest thing, cute, cutest thing. This is the cutest thing, cutest thing, cutest thing. This is the cutest thing ever. 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 Think ever, think ever. This is the cutest thing ever. This is the cutest thing ever. This is the cutest thing ever. Think ever, think ever, ever.